You want to beat me with a shovel? Why are you on the side of her house? What? Why are you on the side of her house? Why are you on the side of her house? There's no, your kid is not here. Your kid is not here. He got a shovel. What? You got a shovel for what? Beat me with a chest, nigga. Police ass, snitch ass, nigga. Shut up, bitch. Your son's not here. He's gone. I already told you. He's out of town. Hope you never see your baby again. What? You see it. Gotta do it. That's right. If you don't know, Lakers player Christian Wood has just been propelled to viral stardom over a situation happening with his son and his baby mother's uh, best friend or one of her friends. Now, the footage that you see in front of you guys is Christian Wood pulling up to this young lady's house asking about the whereabouts of his son. Now, before we go jumping into this uh, story and pulling judgment, you let me know your thoughts. Because this one's a little crazy. He pulled up like he was the grave digger. The Grim Reaper. Which is crazy. Because after he did that, man, this young lady, she went to get into her Meek Mil 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 Mills bag and she got to Twitter fingering, man. She went to get let the uh, ownership of the Lakers franchise know. She wanted to let the Lakers fans know, you got a problem on your hands. What's the problem? The problem is, man, she's saying that Christian Wood, even after hearing that the, her son's where his son's whereabouts is not in her possession, he still decided to pull up with his uh, shovel after making threat to this young lady. So she wanted to make the Lakers organization and fans know the type of player that they have on their roster. I mean, things that make you go what, man? Things that make you go what, man? Let's just jump right into this, and then you tell me your thoughts. You want to beat me with a shovel? Why are you on the side of her house? Why are you on the side of her house? Why are you on the side of her house? There's no, your kid is not here. Your kid is not here. He got a shovel. You got a What? He really came with the sh What? You got a shovel for what? Give me with a chest, nigga. Yeah, we gotta know for what, man. Let us know for what. Is it snowing out there? Police ass, snitch ass, nigga. Shut up, bitch. Your son's not here. He's gone. I already told you. He's out of town. Hope you never see your baby again. What? I mean, after that situation that you just seen took place. This young lady decided to take to Instagram and let, yes, the ownership of the Lakers know her thoughts about one of her players that's sitting on the roster right now. And let, just to let you know, Christian Wood is not the type of player that can afford to let this thing happen to him and, like, they're going to just brush it off, right? His talent is not that great, okay? Just to let you know. Um, so... Uh, to move forward into the story, we have the friend, the young lady that experienced this situation. She's watching her friend's kid. Now, if you're a young lady out there, let me know. If you're watching your friend's kids and her man pulls up, would you then release your friend's child to the son's mother, to the son's father? I mean, come on. Let's just jump right into it, because this is what she has to say about this situation here. She says, my friend wanted to go to dinner, so I babysat for her son. All of a sudden, this man shows up to my house telling me to give me his son. I never met this man a day in my life. If fumble a family and fumble a contract uh, was a contact person, I would never give my son to somebody 
I don't know. At 5 a.m. in the morning, especially if they have a dispute. Come on, guys. Let me know your thoughts. Are you giving up your, your friend's son over to the other parent? 5 a.m.? Okay. He says, you got a problem? You got a problem? Call the police. And that's exactly what he did. And then threatened my life after the police showed up, um, showed his son safe and sound with the baby mother. <sighs> Came to my door with a shovel, ready to beat my head in. And so he said, Christian Wood, what are you doing, brother? Come on, you know the day and age we in, man. She says, thank God the baby wasn't there. This man is dangerous and not fit to be a father. At the Lakers, at Genie Bus, come on. Of course, at Christian Wood underscore five. Man, I'll see you in court. Oh, my gosh. I'm surprised she didn't tag LeBron and Anthony Davis. Listen, she must have couldn't find the handle for LeBron and Anthony Davis because, I mean, wow. Wow. Let me know your thoughts, man. Are you giving up your friend's kid, whether you're a man or, or, or a woman, come on, to the other parent while you know they're going to do a, do a dispute? Sounds like, man, he found out that his baby mom was out to dinner and he, she want, he wanted to know who is watching his son while his mom's out on a nice date with another guy. Things that make you say what, people? Things that make you say what? Let me know your thoughts, man. Tap in, tap in, tap in. Just to let you guys know, we are covering the debates. You want to put on your post notification bell. Put on your no post notification bell. Let's just jump right into it so I can give you guys more. These are text messages between Christian Wood and this young lady before he showed up back to her house. So she says, man... Uh, I guess they, 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 he's trying to figure out where is his son, you know? This man is probably upset, uh, want to know the whereabouts of his son, probably has some time. You know, we're going to throw him a bone. He, he probably has some time, wants to see his son. Maybe the Lakers are off, I don't know. And he finds out his, son, his mom is probably on a date, probably not giving him the correct um, communication. So he's trying to find the whereabouts of his son. And that sometimes as a man that... Situations like this can be frustrating, and we don't know the whole story, but maybe he's frustrated because he hasn't seen his son in a while. You know, his schedule is probably a little bit conflicting. He has the time, and he really wants to see his son during the time that he has available because, I mean, the Lakers do travel, guys, so we got to keep uh, everything in perspective and not just jump to conclusions, you know. We want to see what would make him react like this, you know. Um, and it's probably uh, something he, he probably has loose screws. If you, if you, because I mean, you show up with a shovel. I know you're upset, but man. So anyway, she goes and says, "Man, I'm giving, I'm giving the baby to her as planned." I don't know if this is uh the son's um baby mom's mom, but Christian goes, "Man, should I have her mom call you?" So it sounds like she she's gonna, this young lady is gonna give Christian Wood's son to the child's baby mother's mother, like the grandmother. And Christian Wood is trying to intercept there, like, you know, he wants to see his son. So he goes, give me my son. No, she's not. I really don't want to get more police involved. So the police were already called. He finds out the son is safe, so he's still trying to, he's still in pursuit of the son. Says, she goes, I don't even know her baby daddy. I'm not giving her child to somebody I don't know. Christian Wood, look up. I'm here, outside. Look at your ring. I'm on the ring. Look at your phone. Says, give me my son. Says, all right, call the police. Good night. Now, that's key because if she's saying good night, remember, this situation happened in the daytime. This is clearly in the daytime. 
in the text messages, she's saying, have a good night. So clearly, this was conversations from the night before. He's probably upset because he's getting a runaround. So he pulls up the next morning saying, shorty, what you said? Where's my son? Things that make you say what, people? Things that make you say what? So he then goes on to say, you know, all my life, I'm really trying to, I'm truly trying to help you. I'm the legal guardian of the child. Yeah, is in jail. If you refuse to give me my son, they will say it's kidnapping. I hope he's trapped. What? What are you implying there, Mr. Wood? What are you implying? I mean, she's going to tell him what's going to happen after she feels threatened. She pretty much says, man, Mr. Wood, the Lakers organization, they're going to be hearing about this. Man, let me know your thoughts. This one is just pretty crazy. Pretty, pretty crazy. Christian Wood, man, you can't pull up on, uh, not, this is not even your child's mom, but this is just a friend. You can't pull up to your friend. You got to be more responsible, man. You got to be more responsible. You can't just pull up thinking you could just threaten people with a shovel. This is a young lady, and you're pulling up with a shovel? Really? Really? Come on, man. You, come on. You know LeBron ain't going to pass it to you after this, man. I, I don't even know if the Lakers are going to keep you after this, man. And this is another thing I want to know for you, from you guys. Ladies, gentlemen, let me know your thoughts. Should people be able to just attack someone like this and then act their company at their boss? She's out here tagging a boss. Now, what if this results in him losing his job Losing his employment, which then creates a, a, a bigger problem because he won't be able to support his son, who he clearly is on a mission to try to see and support. So um, let me know your thoughts. Will the Lakers keep Christian Wood after this? Like, is LeBron going to pass? The, imagine LeBron passing to Christian Wood after this. Man. Things that make you go what? Things that make you go what? Tap in, tap in, tap in. Drop the um, comments in the comment section, man. And again, put on your post notification bell because we will be following the election and doing just pop-up lives. So you're going to want to have your uh, notification bell on. Tap in, tap in, tap in.